First of all, Coach Rafael Fox about today's game and your qualification to the semi-final for the first time. Well, I think when I came here yesterday, I told you about my thought. I know they will come more than the way we play them. I think they underrated it. When you look at our position in the Ghanaian League, somebody lying 40 and you are going to meet him, you know. So before they realized, I had what I wanted and I ran away. So I was expecting a serious opposition here. So when you, you, what I did was to mentally strengthen my boys. I know this thing will happen. And I told them at least we should close the draw if you can't win. So when they had the first goal, I told them to open up because there's no need. The more we sit back, the more they will force us to play. So we also came back and we had a goal and then we sat back again. So seriously, I'm very happy. I'm very excited. For a young club like <laughs> Dreams FC from nowhere to qualify to semi final of Calf Confederation, I think it's a big plus. Yes, uh, gentlemen, after that. Good evening, coach. Congratulations on your win. My name is Prince David Oku, freelance journalist. Now you've arrived in the semi final. Uh, what do, would you say to your team? Because uh, we have some sharks who will qualify for the semi-finals too. So, are you telling them to go all out for it, having come this long, or will you? <laughs> you made, to be you made mention of sharks. Do you go in all out on sharks? You have to plan well. So, we are going to plan to meet the sharks. Okay. Congrats. Thank you. Yes. That's it was a difficult game, but you managed to get the qualification. What lessons do you pick from this particular game going into the semi-final? Well, I would say I did very well to read them. I know we have these difficulties. So mentally, I prepared my boys. I know in football, geographically, when we were in school, they said the higher you go, the cooler it becomes. But in football, the higher you go, the more difficult it, it will come. So we are going to, I'm not, I don't know my, my, my opponent yet. They say either the Malik or the African future. Uh, future is so until I see my opponent. But all the same, we are going to start preparing. Because where we've reached now, we've reached, we've almost had going to the ultimate. So it will be more difficult and then we have to work hard if you want to make anything, but at the end of the day, we will not allow this qualification to put us down. We are going to fight. We have seen it. Yeah, it was more difficult now when we went there. I told them we are going to meet the same. This opposition will be better. It will be more difficult than what we had over there. So I think now people will take it serious now when we go to the semifinals. But trust me, we will we'll, we'll be there. My name is Tofik Mohamed. I work with City Tofik. TV. No, Tofik Mohamed. <laughs> yeah. um, in the first half, your boys were too relaxed. And what was the message that you gave it to them coming to the second half? At the end of the day, they achieved what they wanted. Football is about taking and giving responsibilities. I say something to them because I respect uh, Club de Malia. They are like Kotoko Hansifok. You don't have to rush. and. Definitely, we have to economize our energy to be able to make the 90 or 100 minutes. So that's what I told them. So cool down and there we go. What matters most was when they scored, we also went in and scored. And we called back again. So it was a plan. In order, I, mean, I know they are, they are more experienced than some of my boys. Outside, uh, what do you call him? Entry. Nobody has tasted this. Uh, so. I think the boys have down. I just brought well as easy one down. It was just from second division. My still belief. I, I brought him just when the recession was open, just second round. And look at him. So this is the way we I have to, I don't have to pressurize them. I have to manage them a bit by bit to get what we wanted. Yes, gentlemen. Yeah. Good evening, coach. Congratulations on your win. My name is Prince David Oku, freelance journalist. Now you've arrived in the semi-final of Calf Confederation. What 
Final question. Right. Um, oh, okay, we will tolerate two, three more. Yes, go on. Uh, coach, um, you made history in, 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 uh, in this competition for your team and yourself as well. Um, I want to ask you in a sentence, how would you describe your, I mean, your run in this competition? What do you want me to say? <laughs> you said it all. Okay, I'm happy. We've reached there with this uh, stability when we start having some of the uh, directors of the team did not believe we can make it or did not believe we should go due to the financial aspect of it, not in terms of the game. But the big man himself said, You go. Where wherever we find money to go, we go. So we've never let him down. Seriously, we've never let him down. And he's more than happy. He is more than happy, and we are all happy. Go ahead and see the boys. We are all happy. I'm not saying enough is, en is enough, but we are still going to fight to reach the ultimate. But where Dream, uh, Dream FC have reached today, I think, don't worry. It's a dream come to me. <laughs> Kepler, right. we'll take your last question. Right, Coach, once again, congratulations. Thank you. Very big achievement. But I'm sure you'll be happy, especially the way your subs. I think you won the, you got a qualification from the bench. Yeah. Was it always the plan? For me, Simba was the best player for the minutes he spent. Was it always the plan or you were forced into do substitution? No, no, no. We did the same thing over there. We did the same thing over there. Simba and Didi came in and they changed the face of the game. So. I mean, nobody enters into the field without planning. You understand me? We plan very, very well. If it is because I trusted Aziz will come out, I would have changed him to long and brought in that small boy. But at the end of the day, they came and do the needful. So we thank God.